Hello everyone, I'm here today at Broom Boats on the Norfolk Broads where I've been creating 360 degree virtual tours of each of their holiday boats, which look a little bit like this. Having these interactive tours of each boat on their website is going to mean potential customers can see the boats and look around themselves and ultimately it's going to increase bookings of the boats. There's also lots of hidden benefits of these too, such as increasing SEO and boosting of their website up the Google page, as virtual tours are what's known as sticky content because visitors spend time interacting with them, which Google rewards. In terms of undertaking the project, the first step was to set up the boats ready for the shoot, and once that was all ready, I proceeded to take 360 photos all around the boat, capturing every room and section. We weren't just shooting it inside, of course, but we wanted to showcase the outside too, so I captured both the front and the back of the boat, and the ultimate goal, of course, all along the way is to showcase the boats in their best possible light. Now, reaching that ambition of showcasing them in their best possible light is not always done on site. A lot of it is done back in the studio on the edit. Whether that's enhancing the color, fixing the lighting, or making those sheets look extra crisp, there's some little things that can be done which make a big difference. Once I've finished shooting one of the boats, we drove in the next one to the same spot at the end of the quay to keep all the tours consistent. And from there, got everything ready and proceeded to shoot the next one. As you can see on the boats, we wanted customers to be able to see what the rooms are like with the windows and roofs open or closed too. So to effectively do this, I photographed both shots from the same spot, then opened any windows, then shot it again from that same spot. And after a bit of an edit job, made it look nice and smooth. We did this with boats with canopies too, and for all the different styles of boats to give potential customers a real sense of how they can change their atmosphere. You may have seen in the B-roll for this video, there's been lots of drone shots. So as well as the 360 tours, we've undertaken some aerial film work for Bream for their website and social media. This kind of work is really exciting too, as with TD360, I'm increasingly looking to integrate different media within the virtual tours and include different content. That's it for the video. I hope you've enjoyed this behind the scenes. And as always, if you've got any questions about virtual tours or want to have a chat, then feel free to reach out.